everyone. Hey everyone. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, start again. Hey. Ha don't. No, don't. Okay, do your thing. Say your little line. <laughs> hey everyone, so today we're doing a two question answers video. We're doing one, obviously you can see it on this channel here, and there's also going to be one over on Hamish's channel. So, yeah. Not many of you probably know that he has a channel, but I'll link it down below and you can check it out and subscribe if you like what you see. So I asked on Facebook for everyone to ask questions and we have like a couple hundred here. So we're just going to skip through a few and decide which ones to answer. Andrea asked, Hamish, when you and Shannon met, what was it like knowing she did YouTube? And what was it like when you moved in together? Did you find it a bit odd? Oh, oh I gotta watch what I say here. No, you don't. Just no. say whatever you want. <laughs> nah. Um, when I first met Shannon, she... You weren't that big on YouTube, eh? Not... Nah. Oh, oh, you, you were a little bit, but not like now. Nah, she wasn't that big. We just used to... I didn't really know about it, to be honest. At first... Like, I knew she liked makeup, and I knew she... He knew I did it, and he was just like, oh, okay, that's a bit weird. Yeah. No, I didn't think it was weird. I just thought it was cool for you, if you like doing it. Whatever. Yeah. Just never seen it before, that's all. But yeah, it wasn't that big, and I don't think you were doing it as much, were you? Were yeah, you it was, much? like, not my full-time thing. Yeah. It was just, like, a, like, side hobby. So, it was kind of just, like, whatever. And then, obviously, down the line, it got more and more popular, and then... I saw how well she was doing and that she liked doing it, so I thought it was really, really good. Like, it wasn't odd at all. No. Yeah. Yeah? You don't think it's weird that I just sit here talking to myself? Nah. Cause this? No. Nah, because I've tried to do it as well. Like, I've sat in this room and tried to record something at the very start, and I know how awkward it is. Yeah, it's like... Like, it's really awkward. Because <laughs> she asked something else. Did you find it odd when we moved in together? No? Why would I find it odd? Um, no, like, with YouTube and stuff. Oh, okay. Yeah, no, it's not odd. She just does it while I'm at work and whatever. Okay. It's all good. Hayley Winona asks some tips for high school and NCEA. NCEA is a joke. It's so easy. Like, Go so, for achieves. So long, like, I was, I wasn't an achieve girl. I was an excellent girl. I was an achieve guy. I don't care. But if you just want to pass and you don't really care about getting amazing grades, like, honestly, all you have to do is but literally do the classwork. Like, and you'll, you'll have enough knowledge to be able to pass easily, yeah. eh? Like, and, that's all you have to do. No, but NCA doesn't, like, the excellences and stuff like that, I don't see how they even mattered. It doesn't really. Unless you, you go get... for a job right after high school, Yeah. it doesn't matter. And scholarships. Yeah. If you want to get scholarships. But I just, there's like 10 questions in a test for NCA, and I think I got three achieves and one merit, because that's all you needed to get. I know it sounds lazy, but I passed, and I went to university and passed university, so... Comes yeah. down to how, like, uni's so different to it's so high different. school. It's nothing. Like, yeah. it's it's all you have to do the work. So, so long as you're committed and you want to do the work, you'll be fine. And if you really want to be able to make sure that you pass, take subjects where you're allowed to do open book tests. Like, I remember food and nutrition. I took food and nutrition. <laughs> you're allowed to... I, it was actually hard. Like, I remember yeah. one of them. But you, you were allowed to have your books open. And, like, you could just copy all the answers straight out of your book. Like, really? Yeah. Like, how does anyone fail that? Yeah. <laughs> I, yeah, I know. No, I didn't fail one, but I, um, I've i done exams all the way through my uni life, and then in my last year I had an open book test, and I didn't know it was an open book until, like, the night oh. before. I took the book in, and I hadn't, like, made notes of important yeah. points. So I sat there the whole time, like, trying to get everything 100% correct and like reading all the answers out of the book and putting them in. So it was, it can be bad, but Shannon's obviously used to it. Are you? Mm. Yeah. Vanja, oh gosh, Schmalkel. Who was your man crush? No, 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 Me. no, no, not, we're not answering that. Okay. Would you rather eat a peanut butter and salami sandwich oh. or a jam and gherkin sandwich? Jam and gherkin for me, because I hate peanut butter. What like, was oh, that again? Peanut butter and what? Peanut butter and salami. You'd obviously rather have yeah, peanut butter Yeah, I'd do the peanut butter. And, and I'd have jam and gherkin, even though that sounds foul. I like gherkins, so I like jam, but together that sounds a bit odd. Why would you have sweet and, like, sour? Any, it's oh, not well, supposed yeah, to be a delicious kind of combination, I don't think. It's a, would you rather? Yeah, I knew that. Sophie asked, did you play any sport as a child? What did you play? Soccer? Yep. Soccer? I did, yeah, I did it for a couple of years and was alright. But what do they mean by sport? Because we used to do cross country and stuff like that. Yeah, well, that's still. Yeah. Yeah, we used to do cross country running, athletic running, triathlons, biking, heaps. And I actually did really good at triathlons too. Up until. Oi, jealous. Up until I was. 
how old was I? Maybe 17, 16? And then I just saw no point in it and started going to the gym. And that's all I do now. Mm -hmm. I, I did swimming um, mm -hmm. when I was young and then I quit after a while. I think I got terrified of the water for some reason. Like I watched a scary movie and I just refused to swim. I could never get <laughs> really the breathing good. right, eh? Hey? Yeah, I was a real good swimmer. I used oh. to be in like the class like three years above my age. Oh really? Yeah. That's um, good. And I did netball for a couple of years. It was all right, and then yeah, um, did a bit of cross country. I was quite good at cross country. Right, like I don't know. I was always good when I was a little kid because you know how like when the five year olds do cross country, everyone yeah. just kind of like ah! and like <laughs> really like doesn't even care about anything, and like yeah. you always come first. Like, everyone seems. To go. I'm sure they just say everyone comes first. Yeah. I don't know because I have like certificates from when I was a little kid, like first cross country, second cross country from yeah. when I was like five. Oh, what about shot put and discus and stuff? That's not a sport. That's just what you do once a year at well, school. That's athletics. Sport. Anyway, let's carry on. Yeah, let's carry on. Brittany Blankenship asked, "What is your favorite junk food?" Yeah. What's your favorite junk food? Oh, Butter chicken. I'm yep. lately oh, we've both gosh. been on a buzz, eh? No, <laughs> tell them about our thing that we have with it that annoys us. Hey, everyone's like, oh, okay, but it's everyone, eh? You go. Everyone. <laughs> if you like go to someone that loves Indian food and you're, they're like, oh. What kind of Indian food do you order? And you're like, butter chicken. They'll just be like, oh, butter chicken. Like, oh, I hate and they just it. hate on you for liking butter chicken. But like, Bevan? Bevan? Bevan, if you're watching this, oh. butter chicken is good and you just hate on it because it's mainstream. But we are mainstream and butter chicken is the best one. We think. Like, we've gone me. we've gone out uh, for dinner and we've tried different, one, different ones, eh? Yeah, Korma. And what are the other ones? I don't like even Rogan, know. Josh, They've got names that are just stupid to say. All sorts, as well. eh? Like, yeah. But none of them have ever ever been as good as butter chicken always is. Yeah. Like, whenever you get butter chicken, there's like a 90% chance it's going to be pretty good. So, it's safe. You're going to put butter chicken sales through the roof now. Yeah. Because you've said you like it. Yeah. Kind of like that coconut oil. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, if it was, don't include butter chicken, like just the mainstream takeaways. Mainstream takeaways. I hate saying mine, because it's, it's... Yours is very mainstream. Go McDonald's? Mac he like, loves just Mac attacks. Yeah. Three dollar Big Macs, if, if they flash that sign round down the road, I just try and park it. I just get them. I get like three. I so like big. I prefer Burger King and Carl's Jr. Yeah. Um I like yeah. Maccas sometimes, but I just find that their burgers are really you know, the I plain? No, the only thing I like is Big Macs really. Hmm. That's the only reason I like it. It's been ten minutes so we've asked like three questions. So it's all good. <laughs> Robin McCarthy asks, What's your favourite movie of all time? That's good. You go. I don't know though, I hate this question. No. Nah. I'm just gonna say something like, um, 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 um. Oh, can we just change it to TV show? I'm gonna say my favorite recent one. Okay, it can be, we'll do both. So my favorite yeah. movie currently, like that I've seen recently, is the Identity Theft. Identity Theft? Oh, Thief? okay, yeah, Identity comedy. Yeah, yeah, I liked that one. I, I thought that was actually really yeah. funny and I wasn't expecting it to be as good as it was. Yeah. It was really good. What was your favourite recent movie? Um, of all time? It's not really recent. Okay, your favourite oh, movie. I'm going to say two. That's breaking the rules two? up. Two? Yeah, like oh, yeah, so. yeah. Two. It's Shutter Islands, which is Leonardo DiCaprio, and it's like a complete mindfuck. Or Inception, which is exactly similar. the same. It's similar. No, but they're different. I know they're different. I like Shutter Island better than Inception, personally. I like both. I love the We should watch them again, because you know how those are the kind of movies you can watch and watch and watch and you always learn something new? Yeah, but I've watched them like three times <sighs> each. But yeah. Of course you have. Um, okay, favourite TV show, quit. <laughs> you go. Uh, uh, uh. Can I say what yours is and you say what mine is? You probably don't know mine. No, I don't know yours. Neither do I. His is Breaking Bad. Yeah. This best big, show ever. Watch it, advocate. sit there and watch five seasons of it. It is the best. Okay, I've got a few. Game of Thrones? Game of Thrones, Breaking Bad, Dexter. Mm, um, but we're breaking the rules again. I know, I don't care. Okay. Um, what else did I love? Those are... Those, American Horror Story, but the second one, the Asylum yeah. one. So wait, start again. What do we recommend? We're just going to change it. Okay, what do we recommend? Recommend. All breaking, of those ones I just breaking, said. Just start again. Breaking, breaking Bad, Bad, Game, Game of, of Thrones, Thrones are the two best. Spartacus, really good. She doesn't Dexter. like it. Dexter. Yeah. But only from like, well the first and second ser series were like kind of average. The fourth season's amazing. Yeah. Like amazing. And then it just gets better. And then the last, like the most recent one's kind of shit. It's still a good show. It's, it's still good though. Okay. You still have to watch it. Cause, anyway. Yeah. Um, and what else do we watch? That are real, it has to be real good. I've forgotten now. Prison Break was good. Yeah, we watched Prison that. Break that was the first was thing yeah. we ever watched together. But it's kind of, nah, that'll do. Next question. Okay, okay, okay. I've got a good one. Ah, this is a good one. Ready? Ready, ready, ready. Okay. What? 
What was your first impression of Hamish? And what was his first impression of I, you? Why? Why do people know these? Okay, okay. Say what your first impression of me was. I thought she was a bitch. Yeah, be honest. Yeah, I just did. <laughs> and I thought he was a whiny pussy, like, crybaby um, boy. I'm not gonna get into that. <laughs> nah. Well, I think we'll have to save this for the boyfriend tag when we do it, because that's one of the questions, and we'll go more into depth then. Yeah. But that was our first impression. I actually was. thought she was a bitch, and Kelly. I, I yeah, love Kelly's he thought Kelly. He thought Kelly was worse than me. He yeah. thought that she was like a total snob. Mm. I know, I don't, we're not getting into this because it's the whole thing. No, we'll go, we'll go into that in a different video. Okay, what are you most scared of? Heights, spiders, close spaces, etc. Probably spiders and heights. He's terrified. Tell not me. spiders so much. Nah, when we heights. were on a ferris wheel, he was like... He no, was like, then it, no. <laughs> you were. Don't, bullshit. You were, you I know wasn't. It. He was. It's bullshit. He was. I, I used to work for a scaffolding company and it's scary. Oh yeah, and he that was quit a, after like a day because he was scared. I'm put this in. <laughs> Why? Because that annoys the shit out of me. No, I didn't. I just didn't enjoy it. Okay. <laughs> okay, what am I most scared of? Um, I don't really know. Like, I'm not... I don't what like do heights. Like? What, what am I most scared of? I don't like heights, but I'm not like... I can still go up high and I'm not like gonna cry and, you know, go all anxious and shit. And I don't like spiders, but I'm not gonna be one of those girls that's like, ah, you know? Yeah. And I don't like tiny spaces, but if it's not for long, I'll be fine. I don't know. I don't really have anything that I'm really yeah. scared of. Oh. Uh, animals getting hurt? Yeah. If that Does even that even counts. count? I don't know. No, whatever. If animals are getting, like, hurt or mistreated, I'll, like, turn into a crippled little crybaby. Even if it's, like, a bee? Yeah. That's not an animal, it's an insect. Um, wait, one thing that makes you cringe real bad. No one asked that. Hamish hey, Kenard asked that. <laughs> cringe real bad? Like, what's something that just makes you like, ugh, that's disgusting? Other than chalk on the whiteboard or what, chalk on the blackboard, sorry. Because you always do that on the computer. Yeah, on the, wait, touch the back of an iMac with a USB stick. Is it, it's an iMac, hey? Yeah. Oh, God, it's bad. But that's not my one. Yeah, go. Cleaning up source of shit. Oh, yeah. yeah, I don't cringe at that at all. I don't know. What so, makes me cringe? What makes you cringe? My one's good and it's fucking disgusting. Well, I, def I usually do it as well. Cleaning oh, the yeah. hair from the bottom of the shower and all the girls have been in the shower. See, I don't care about that. Cause oh, I like, I get my vomit on. What's it called? Dry rage. Yeah, he does. He's like, oh. <laughs> and you can hear him like burping and stuff. It's so foul. I hate it. That's now, I don't know. Like. What makes me really like... Maybe just, we'll just do a few more. Okay, okay. Um, what's your favourite alcoholic drink? Oh! What is it? What's okay. your, what's your favourite kind of beer first? My favourite kind of beer is Heineken or Steinlager Pure. Steinlager Pure is a New Zealand beer, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, it is. So you, some of you might not know what that is. They're very similar. Um, and my favourite alcohol, I love it, I'm getting all serious about this, eh? Clearly not an alcoholic. Um, my favourite spirit, maybe Jaeger, if it's with yeah. Red Bull, but not Jaeger by itself. Like, it, it has to be with Red Bull. Mine is Malibu, but I don't drink it much because it's terrible, eh? It's got so many calories in it, yeah. and I've, I've scared myself away from it because it's real bad. Like, I try to drink vodka. Mm. I hate vodka though. Like, I drink cruises because I'm cool. Raspberry cruises. Yeah, no, they're nice. Good. You like them, eh? Yeah, I do. 20 bucks for a box isn't bad. Otherwise, yeah, if I if I just didn't even care about, like, maintaining my weight or anything, I'd just drink a whole bottle of Malibu, like, every weekend. And Shannon says I have puppy eyes. I don't have puppy eyes, eh? Like, that was really random. I don't know. He does, though. He has I puppy. don't. Puppy eyes. You do! You have happy eyes. No, I don't. You do, you have puppy okay, cute happy eyes. Okay, cut that eyes. out. No. Just keep that. Okay, so that's all we're going to answer in this vlog because it's already long enough. So that's my one done. And now, if you want to go hear some more from us, if you enjoy this, go to this channel. The yep. link will be down below. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video and we will talk to you soon. See ya. <laughs>